Hey guys, as here. The year is almost over, so I wanted to come on, especially because today is my birthday. Yes. Today I am 31 at 12:01 a.m. exactly. Um I am sick. Boo. And I've also got my daughter sick. Um, but prayerfully, we'll be getting better soon. I guess just a life update, guys. Honestly, this year has been, the ending of this, this year has been really, really tough, to be honest. Um, my uncle was murdered four months ago, so, and then, um, my back neighbor who we have literally known for years we just had her funeral just two weeks ago and then Thursday I have found out about the death of my father so um, now we are planning that funeral um, so yeah, I just feel like it's been a lot of death lately. Um, a lot of sadness lately. And it's it's crazy because I was literally just saying to God, like, Lord, honestly, I don't think that before the year is over, I, could, I can take any more bad news. And it's like, boom. My dad. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, for everyone out there who is still blessed to have, or will be blessed to have their mother and father going into 2020. Yeah. So, if you're gonna have that blessing because it's definitely a blessing i hate to be the one coming in like oh reach out to your loved ones before it's too late but honestly unfortunately sometimes death makes makes reality sit in and um not that i hadn't reached out to my father we had literally just talked um, I guess I just want to remind anyone there's a I've I've known and run into a lot of people who have said like oh I was angry with my mother or my father or this family member or that family member and um, I never got to settle things before they died but don't let that be you if they're on your mind call them text them have to learn how to let go and move forward. Let go and move forward and forgive. Unconditional love. It's easy to love, but unconditional love, no matter what an individual may be personally going through. Death is for sure inevitable. And at some point in time, you, myself, and the others around you will eventually meet death. Oh, um, of everything that I will have of my father, um, my best and my favorite will be our Bible studies and what he has allowed me to grow up in concerning God's word. And I know that my dad would say, just make sure you're right with God before your time comes. Make sure you're right with God. He would always say, the good Lord only promises us 70 years. Anything after that is a blessing. Your spiritual health, it's, it's important and it should be important. Um, and yeah, I don't want to get on here to preach. Not tonight, not today. All right, guys, so keep a sister in prayers. 
to all of my praying warriors. Um, I know that God will be with me. Um, yeah. And if you don't see me again before the new year, may yours be blessed. May yours be blessed. Good night.